you smoke a lot of marijuana. Mm -hmm. How often do you smoke these days? Uh, I smoke every day. Like, I try to smoke every day. I must try to smoke every day, but, like, I always smoke, but not like that because I didn't have the money to smoke all the time. But now since I got more money, I buy, like, zip. I buy zips a lot. Like, I just bought a zip, like, this morning. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got a zip on me right now. Is it just marijuana you smoke? Yeah. Yeah. Smoking marijuana can do different things for different people. What does it do for you exactly? It helped me, like, just start back thinking like this. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, like, being weird and, like, like if, you follow, like, if you see me on Instagram, like, you see I be doing, like, crazy videos. I be doing all type of shit. Like, a bitch is shaking ass in the pool. Like, I be goddamn, like, do all type of shit. So, like, to have all them type of thoughts in your mind and then have to go back to straight, you got to be high. You know what I'm saying? So I had to be high to, like, keep that shit. Plus, I got a lot of shit going on in my fucking life right now. Like, so much bullshit going on. Is it a favorite strain you enjoy? There's a lot of different names out there, a lot of different strains. Yeah, I mean. What do you I like? Mean, I fuck with gelato, though. But, like, I don't get my hands on like that much, so, like, I get my hands on OG a lot. Now, why those strains for you? Why do you like those compared to other stuff? Like, my, me and my homeboys, like, because, like, sometimes it'd be, like, some people just, like, now, I don't know somebody to keep it real. Everybody try to like they just smoke the most exotic weed all the time. Like, it's going to be sometimes where you, like, get your hands on some shit that's just, like, it's straight. You know what I'm saying? And that straight shit, that, we call it the sleepy weed. That shit will get you sleepy. I don't like that type of weed. You know what I'm saying? So, I like, really like the OG and, like, the shit like that. That shit will have me, like, I still can, like, move and I be on my, you know what I'm saying? I be still making my moves. I still be in the studio. I still could, you know what I'm saying? But some weed, that, 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 that bullshit weed, like, the... That should have had me sleepy. Like, I'd be like, I get the land down and it's over with. How do you smoke it? I like backwoods. You do? I like, I like the backwoods, you know what I'm saying? Certain backwoods flavor? I was fucking with the Russian creams because they used to have it at the BP by my spot, but like, they don't have it no more. So, like, shit, like, it just be the honey now. You know what I'm saying? Now, take us back. Do you remember the very first time you smoked marijuana? Yeah, yeah, I remember. It's like the fucking yesterday. Nigga. Paint that picture for us. Nigga, I was in the fucking truck. I used to have this old-ass Ford Ranger. It was old as fuck, like 93 Ford Ranger. And me and this nigga that I used to work with at McDonald's was in the car smoking. We had the windows up and shit. Dog, I was so fucking high, bro. Like, and me, like, I was panicking. So I'm walking. We supposed to get ready for work. I had to be to work at three, so I get out the whip. I ain't put my shoes on or nothing. I done walked in my job. I'm like, my heart beating fast. My heart beating fast. My heart beating fast. Call the ambulance. Call the, call the ambulance. I'm in that bitch. High as fuck. We done smoked some mid. I'm high as fuck. We in McDonald's. I'm telling the goddamn manager, call the ambulance. I ain't got on no shoes. I got down. And then, like, the ambulance came. I'm in the back of the ambulance. Before we even get to the cab medical, my high went away. So I'm like, damn, I probably lost my job. Mm. Goddamn, I just, I ain't got no shoes on. <laughs> I just look stupid as fuck. So luckily, I didn't lose my job. I went back in the job. Everybody clowning me like, they're like, ah, oh, call the ambulance, call the ambulance. Everybody just joining my ass like, I remember that was my first time being high. That shit had me fucking, my shit was like beating like a motherfucker. I thought I was finna die. Was it influence? Was it peer pressure? Was it curiosity? It was, I was just curious because like my uh, coworkers, they used to come to work and they used to be high. And I used to be like, man, them niggas like, I was like, shit, goddamn, like shit. Like, man, they cool, they chilling, you know what I'm saying? And I was going through some shit like, like I always be having problems with bitches, dog. Like, with bitches, bro. And I was fucking with this bitch, bro. And this bitch was, like, trying to play me, bro. And I was like, man, I'm finna get high. I want to get high. Because they, they, they always used to be talking about how getting high used to make them, like, you know what I'm saying? So I was like, man, I'm finna get high, bro. And then, like, at first, you know what I'm saying? I'm t Really, it was, like, on some social. It's social. You know what I'm saying? It was on some social shit. Because it's like, 
he I wanted to talk to bro about it because he was older than me, but he smoked. And I, you know what I'm saying? So it was like two birds, like curiosity, social, we talking about it. And then we talked about the shit and I got everything out. But by the time I got out of the car, it was like I had just like walked into a world. And I'm like, God damn, how's a bitch? You know what I'm saying? Now, your first time smoking, uh, or your first time getting high, I should say, was at McDonald's. You called for an ambulance. Mm -hmm. uh, with a experience like that, which sounds terrible, you, you, you described your heart beating real fast. This time, third. What would make you just try this again? Because somebody watching this might think, if you had such a bad experience, yeah. what led you into becoming an everyday smoker at this point? Fucking... Shit, the money, bro. Like, I'm telling you, like, the money shit, bro. I'm telling you, the money make you do hella shit. Like, fucking, like, when I first started, then I did, I did, I smoked that time. I was goddamn geek, though. I was tripping. Then, like, my other homeboys, they all in prison right now, though, but, like, they smoked a lot of weed, bro. So, like, I used to smoke with them sometimes, but I didn't have to really, I used to be, like, on some social shit. Like, I'm just, you know what I'm saying? Like, not even inhaling it like they inhaling it. So it's like, you know what I'm saying? It was just on some social shit. Like, my partner smoked, we smoked, you know what I'm saying? I'm young as fuck, you know what I'm saying? But then, like, as I got older, niggas started having problems and shit. Like, niggas getting locked up. Niggas is getting in trouble. Niggas is being broke. Niggas car broken down on the side of the road. Nigga, the music ain't moving like how I wanted to move. Nigga ain't living where he want to live. Nigga got to, I don't want to think about this shit. I want to get high, bro. So then, like, that shit started helping me with it. Like, when I really started, like, getting high and then I was like, damn, that shit ain't making me think about it. Like, I'd be, like, chilling, you know what I'm saying? And then I'd be back on my straight. Like, I'd be back on my straight and narrow, like, okay, all right, bet, I'm, I'm back. I'm fucking goddamn, boo, 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 I can get to it. You know what I'm saying? Did your parents ever catch you smoking that young? Yeah, yeah, my mom, like, my sister smoked in, like, see, my mama, like, my mama, like, you know how you got down, you got the mama and the, your, 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 the parent, like, everybody go to their house after school? That's my house. My house used to be like that. Like, uh -huh. after school, my mom was the candy lady. So, after school, everybody go to my mama's house to play basketball. If you want to fight, if you don't like somebody, you're going to fight in my mama's yard. You know what I'm saying? And then, like, my sister smoked weed. That's how I have my sister smokes weed a lot. So, she younger than me, though. But my sister smoked weed a lot. And then, like... My mama got like these tables in the garage. And my mama was like, shit, I'd rather y'all smoke weed at the house than be out there getting in trouble for the shit. So like we got tables with ashtrays and shit. So I was just mm. like, shit, my mama opened to us. So now I started smoking and I told her, you know what I'm saying? But she just was like, as long as you don't have that incident again, you know what I'm saying? Because I done had that incident happen a couple more times since the McDonald's shit. You know what I'm saying? That ain't the only time. That shit happened a couple more times. And my mama don't like that shit. You know what I'm saying? My heart be doing like weird shit. So. But now, since I can, you know, I'm cool, I can cope with that shit, she cool. Like, my mama like that shit. Like, she cool. Like, you know what I'm saying? She's not a smoker? Hell no. My mama don't do shit. Like, no drugs. Like, I don't know why she's so cool. <laughs> my mom, like, was the candy lady, bro. Like, my mom was, like, a hustler. Like, but she do not fuck with no drugs. She don't fuck with no violence. She don't fuck with none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? But she's just, like, she not slow. You know what I'm saying? If it happened, it happened. Now, you do smoke every day, if not every day? Every day. Every day. Um, why so much? Because I be doing a lot. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, when you're trying to, you know, like, when you're a real ambitious person, bro, you trying to do some shit, like, I'm pretty sure you know, like, you be trying to knock out as many things as you can in 24 hours. And I'm that nigga. Like, I'm, the, I'm that nigga who going to get up, nigga. If I can, I ain't gonna lie, sometimes I don't get up that early. But when I get up, I'm trying to go to the studio. I'm trying to figure out what videos we finna shoot. I'm trying to figure out what rescues we finna push. I'm trying to figure out what photo shoots we finna do. I'm trying to figure out what we doing over here. I'm trying to have a meeting with this person. I'm trying to make this plug, you know what I'm saying? So sometimes I might do 15 things in one day. It ain't no way in hell that I'm finna do all that shit without getting high. You know what I'm saying? I was just saying, I was in the car the other day. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know what I'm saying? I was in the car with somebody the other day. And I was just like, man, God damn, like, I got damn, got smoke. You know what I'm saying? I was in the car with Keisha shit. And, you know, she got damn, she Muslim. So, like, you know what I'm saying? She on Ramadan. You know what I'm saying? So, she ain't smoking. You know what I'm saying? She don't smoke like that. So, I'm like, what the fuck? I gotta get high. But I'm with her all day, so I wasn't doing it. Mm. 
You know what I'm saying? I was finna lose my fucking mind. I was having a bad ass fucking day. And I was so mad. And I had got some weed. Do you think it's your tolerance that you smoke so much? I understand you wanting to get everything done in 24 hours, but do you think maybe if it was a stronger strain you were smoking than what you smoke now, you wouldn't smoke as much? No, I smoked the strongest, and, and even like, like even when we, like we were just out in Cali last week, like I smoked, like I was smoking some strong shit, but I smoking that shit back to back. And, and, and I ain't gonna lie, I like the act too of smoking. You know what I'm saying? Like I like the, it's like I, maybe I think that all that shit goes into soothing me, like the the act of the smoking, the feeling of the high, because I could be high as fuck. Like when I'm high, I'm high, bro. So when I, I can, I done been high as fuck, and I still just smoke. I'll be high and still roll a blunt, or have somebody roll a blunt for me and, and and smoke, and we smoke and smoke and smoke and smoke. I smoke like I just keep smoking. Are you addicted? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I'm pretty, I think so. Like, you know, what I'm saying my mom just was telling me that she called me. She said it's some shit they dip in the backwoods in. <laughs> she said some shit they dip in the backwoods in that make you addicted to it. And I was like, you know what? It gotta be because like, you know what I'm saying? See me, I'm just a real nigga. I don't give a fuck. Like fucking when you got the last of the weed, you can roll that shit like in a switch or a Dutch. The backwoods is for when you rolling a lot of fucking weed. You know what I'm saying? So, for the main part, most part, we're smoking backwoods. And I be liking smoking the motherfuckers. And I, it, might, it's, it might be some shit. They might be dipping that shit in some shit. I don't know. I like that shit. I like, the, I like the way that shit. I just like that shit. You know what I'm saying? Longest you went without weed. Sounds like you went without it that one day. Lately, late, late, lately, was in the lately, because of the Ramadan, like lately, because of her doing, like, like her Ramadan, like it's like you know what I'm saying, like I just got a zip today, this morning. Yesterday I tried to get one, but the weed man wasn't pulling up. I was at my um my home but I see a producer chase the money. I was at his house last night, and I told my plug to pull up, and that nigga just didn't fucking pull up. But luckily, they were smoking, but they weren't smoking. Like, they had, like, a blunt or two. Matter of fact, we mixed some weed. I had some weed in my bag, and then we mixed it with some shit they had, and then we had a blunt. You know what I'm saying? It was cool. I was straight. You know what I'm saying? So it was probably like a day or two. Like a day or two. Like. Ever been asked to quit? Mm-mm. Like, my manager, sometimes he, like, be, like, he don't be, like, my manager, like, real, like, you know what I'm saying? Because he managed us. He managed me and Keith, and then he managed goddamn, like, some some kids too, so he don't really fuck with that shit. He like like kitty shit, like you know what I'm saying. Like he real Nickelodeon, you know what I'm saying. He don't really like. <laughs> he don't fuck with that shit. Though. He don't fuck with like weed and like he don't fuck with like weed and like shit like that. So he be telling me like, man, man, why ain't on that weed, man, smoking that weed, that, 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 that weed, like literally like on our way over here. He talking about you driving like that with that weed in car. Like he be bitching this shit about the weed and shit. He a good guy. He a good guy. He don't like that shit. Ever tried to quit? No. 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 Because it's like my creative, like, it helps my creativity. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, literally, like, literally, and this ain't even on no cocky shit. I literally would smoke and go to the fucking studio and I could finish, like, a whole fucking mixtape. In like four days, bro. And that motherfucker be hard too. Like motivational purposes only. Like we literally that's what there was the fuck that's what we was doing. Like we was smoking weed and we went to the studio like for a week straight and just picked the best shit. And that shit hard. It's fuck, like, you know what I'm saying? What about women? Is that ever been a deal breaker for you? The fact that you are a marijuana smoker. Maybe they don't smoke. Or maybe they don't smoke. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, like, no, they don't. It don't make them not fuck with me, but like, they can. I can't smoke in the crib. Like, have you have you lost a relationship or something because you're a smoker, they're not, or you smoke weed and they don't? No, 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 no. Because I'm real, like, chill person. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm real, like, chill. Like, I ain't like reckless. Like, I ain't gonna be around that bitch just smoking the ash and everyone and shit like that. I'm real, like, you know, I keep shit clean. You know what I'm saying? I don't really be. Nah, that ain't never been like a problem. Like, I ain't just like. You feel me? And really, when I be smoking, it's probably me and my boys. And I'm not at that spot. Plus, that's why I just got me another spot. I got me a spot. You know what I'm saying? So I could just, I do what I want. Smoking shit. 
marijuana can be an expensive habit. With yeah, your yeah. <laughs> with your personal use, let's say a month. Have you ever calculated how much you spend on marijuana? Rough estimate. Well, it's like seven days in a week. Four weeks in a month. Well, at least like through through four thousand dollars. Got to be. You just made me feel bad because I don't even be adding that shit up. I just go as I, I be like, oh yeah, I just got the feature. Let me take this hundred, two hundred off by weed. But now you're making me think, hell yeah, that shit is like adding up. $4,000, 12 months in a year. That's almost $50,000 in one year you spend on marijuana. Rough estimate. That's crazy. That ain't right. But shit, it is what it is. It is what it is. I got a lot of little habits and shit. I know that if I took, if I if I kick that shit, I can goddamn have more money. You know what I'm saying? But I just be spending. Like I be spending shit like the hell of clothes and shoes and like now like I don't I don't fuck around and like got in the jury a little bit. Like it's just. You know is I mean? is it worth it though? And now that we've come up with this figure, forty eight thousand dollars, right? Almost fifty a year you spend on marijuana. Is the amount of money you spend on it worth it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Why? Cause like, bro, like I'm goddamn like I'm I'm telling you like sometimes I think I'm fucking crazy, bro. Cause like I'll fucking like I'm telling you, bro. Like I will have a fucking meltdown, dog. Like I be having like them days, bro. Sometimes I had them days, bro, and I'm real dramatic too, you know what I'm saying? And I got there, I'm real hard on myself. So like if some shit ain't going right, bro, I be tripping, bro. Like for real, I be tripping, bro. Like my friends will tell you, bro, like I be tripping, bro. Like sometimes I have my times like where I be tripping, like I be tripping, bro. Like, nah, yeah, it's worth it. It's worth it. Like for real, for real, that shit's worth it. We never see that side of you on social media. Hell no. We only see the girl in the jacuzzi with the but shake into your songs. Yeah, you see that? Yeah. Or me giving the, like, giving the motivational speeches and shit. I be got A lot of motivational captions. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But we don't see the, the, the trippy side of you. No, nah, because I be, I be high. I be high. I got down, you know what I'm saying? Every pick, like, you know what I'm saying? Before I even fucking, like, because Batwoods used to follow me. I don't know why y'all don't follow me. You feel me? But they used to follow me. You feel me? Like, I, every pick, I was goddamn. We got that. The blunt somewhere around that motherfucker somewhere. Fat ass blunt right there. Like, it's there. You know what I'm saying? So, shit. Like, hell yeah. Like, but on social media, I be, I be chilling, bro. Especially, like, if a nigga done flick me up or I'm like, hey, yeah, crank, crank me up real quick. Record me real quick. I'm finna say some shit. Because that's how I be, like, spur of the moment. Like, hey, bro, I got some shit I'm finna say real quick. Crank me up real quick. I be good. I be in a good little mind space.